name is Ciara Murray. My name is Amelia Laguerre. My name is Anagir Azmanchi. My name is Nancy hirsch Nelsoretta. And my name is Molly Nelson. This is the Argentina Girl Scouts, and we, here, we are here today to talk about school lunches. Thank you to the cooks, the farmers, and the people and the people who prepare the school lunch lunches. My name is Loretta, and I've been working here since December first. My name is Karen. I've been working here about two years. My name is Loretta, and I've been working here since December first. We love the children. The students Seeing are the best. Seeing these smiley faces every day, interacting. How are you? How's your day? Yeah. What are you going to do today? Some children we've known since they were born. I think on average day we make 800 lunches. The menu is determined by the season. I believe there's a vegetarian option every day. And there's the salad bar. Beautiful bath. salad bar. I believe some of the food is prepared elsewhere. And we do the finishing touches here. Many options on there. Protein. Very, very fresh. Yeah. I love eating lunch here. I really enjoy it. With my co-workers, I really enjoy it. Oh, I love them. I stay every day for them. I haven't missed one. <laughs> They're delicious and warm, colorful. Big composting. It's picked up daily. We recycle plastic and trash. And, we and the kids are very good about sorting things out. <laughs> Hi, my name is Amelia, and I'm here with Jack. What's how do you like the school lunches? Uh, I think they're fine. What would you if you could if you could do anything to change them? Would you what would you do? I would change their options. Uh, for example, uh, add more choices of different foods. I've actually never had the school lunches. I always plan to bring my own, but I know that they're not always vegetarian friendly for the main meal, but I've never actually had them, so I can't say. I, as my observations is that there are some things that are for lunch that students really like, and other things that maybe aren't so popular, which was true when I was in school as well. Um, but I don't know. I think overall, many people do like them. I do think that there is a variety of options throughout the days of the week, just not necessarily a variety of options each day, I would say. I think having more of, uh, of a variety of protein sources would be nice. So not just having like grilled cheese sandwich, but maybe more um, kinds of like tempeh or tofu or seitan or other things that are maybe a little wider variety. Hi, my name is Ciara, and today I am here with my friend Nancy, who is a vegetarian. How long have you been a vegetarian for? Um, I think about a year and a half. What is your opinion on the school lunches? Um, I think they're good, but I think they could be improved, and um, I don't really think they have enough protein or vegetarian options. Mm. That I, I mean, like protein that isn't meat. I agree. Also, what if you were to be in charge of the school lunches? What would you, what vegetarian options would you like to add? Um, I think we could add like veggie dogs and veggie burgers, and um, like other veggie options, and as well as meat. But like, there's also options as like veggie, like, like let's say if there's a burger and that's what they're having for lunch, there would also be a veggie burger. Would you do anything to improve the lunches they have right now? Um, I would add more vegetarian options and I think I would also have like more healthy options, which um, lots of kids like. I think that there should be Every day there should be another option besides salad bar for vegetarians because um, salad is kind of like a side option. If you're having a meal, then you'd have salad on the side sometimes. And 
instead of for your whole meal. Okay, thank you for letting us interview you. You look hot. How do you think we could change the school? We could change the school lunches by adding a bit more of some vegetarian options for the people who are vegetarians and make sure that everyone enjoys the food at the school lunches as if only like some really like it and some like just dislike it. And I think like the salad bar, instead of like having so little like options, we should add like, like make more options so like everyone has more than just like a little amount of food to choose from and like everyone has a variety of food to choose from. Hello everybody, today we are here with Stephanie Hirsch, aka Nancy's mom. But we are going to all ask her a few questions about the school lunches because she herself is a vegetarian. Um, since you have some say in like the school district, would you do do you want to do something to change the lunches at the school? Um, well, let me tell you, you know that I actually had my office in this building for two whole years and it made me so happy to have breakfast and lunch in the school cafeteria every single day. I've never eaten so healthy in my whole life. And what I would do is I would get an amazing salad. I would, I would like put the salad in there and I'd put everything from the salad bar on there. Like the buns with beans. I loved it when they had the little tuna in the container. And I'd eat that and that would make I just wouldn't be so hungry just thinking about it right now. Um, but I do think for kids, I think it's really hard to figure out vegetarian food for kids that they'll eat. I mean, I have that problem as a parent, but I think that probably there are ways to have like substitute, um, if you have pasta, I just have like um, vegetable sauce and, and meat sauce, um, like pizza zizi. Uh, it would be nice if there were some really hearty dishes um, where they just took the meat out. Because salad, kids, kids don't really like salad. Yeah. But, but I love this. There's actually some meals that kids will like. Like, there's green bean casserole. I thought I didn't like it, but now I do. It's delicious. It's all vegetarian. That it's reminds mushrooms. me. Mushrooms. I used to remember this, Nancy. Like years and years ago, we used to when I had my office here. Every time that vegetarian chili appeared on the menu, I would like we would all like do this. I'm so happy in the morning. Mm -hmm. I thought everybody liked this. I love that vegetarian chili so much. Hello, this is Amelia and Nargia from fifth grade interviewing Miss Sniper. So, what is your opinion on the school? I actually think that school lunches, for the most part, are pretty tasty. I really like the pizza, um, and I have had other meals that were served in the cafeteria that were really yummy. Um, but I understand that some of some of the meals are really not so tasty. Um, that it can it can really vary. Some are really good, and some are not so good. When you walk into the school cafeteria to check out some of the school lunches, would you either eat like the ones that are most healthy, or do you eat the um, um, I never go to the salad bar, if that's what you're asking. I always pick the hot lunch because I prefer hot food. Um, but I think that having a salad bar is really important for kids who want choice. And I also think it's a really it's really important for kids who may not like the hot food that's being served. Because um, nothing breaks my heart more than seeing like a whole apple or a little bag of carrots getting just thrown in the trash because a kid does not want to eat it. So I think that having a salad bar is a really good idea so that the kid, for the kid who says, I don't want the apple, I don't want the carrots, but in the salad bar are vegetables I do want. And then they can pick those instead. If you could change any of the lunches or change how they would get the lunches, what would you do? Um, I think I would offer more variety in terms of hot vegetables. Because I feel like, and also improve the quality. Because I feel like if when the vegetables are warm, they can get really soggy. And then kids don't want to eat them. So just maintaining some more of the like freshness and tastiness of those warm vegetable dishes, I think, would make them more appealing. Well, not every kid is going to take food home from school. Some kids do, but not everybody does. I think one option for making sure that that food doesn't go to waste that actually was done in the district I used to work in before I came to Somerville is that uneaten fruit, whole fruits and the and vegetables in packages like the carrots, they were collected and donated to a homeless shelter. So even if the kids are not gonna eat them, that doesn't mean the food has to go to waste. 
the food can be taken and given to another population that is going to eat it, such as the homeless. That's a good idea. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thank you for the interview. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for inviting me. It was very nice. It was a very good interview. Yeah. It was really good. This message is for the city council, the school committee, and also the mayor and the superintendent. First of all, I want to say we should find ways to reuse the fruits and vegetables that have been eaten. For example, we could give all the uneaten fruits and vegetables to a homeless shelter where people will, will eat them and appreciate it. Um, another thing we could do is we could have more vegetarian options. For example, we could have pasta with no meat sauce. We could have veggie burgers and veggie dust and lasagna with no meat. Third of all, we should have longer lunch so kids can eat their food without having to be in a rush. Also, we should be able to eat outside if we want or have the option to eat inside. Third of all, we should have longer recesses after our lunch after we eat our lunch because then we can work off all the food that we have just eaten. And another thing we should do is that we should have is the flower bush should be more filling because sometimes kids are hungry after they eat it because um, sometimes the meat, like there's not enough protein or grains in the flower bush. My name is Ciara Murray. My name is Amelia Laguerre. My name is Nardira Gunchi. My name is Nancy Hurst Dunford. 